For the second straight season, the Austin Bruins found themselves in the Robertson Cup playoffs. This time around, however, their playoff journey was cut short as they were balanced by the Everine Wings in the division semifinals. Despite taking a small step back, Austin Bruins head coach Steve Howard was happy with his team's season and especially how they handled adversity throughout the year. Yeah, I mean, obviously after the season's over, you're, you're looking for answers, right? But uh, looking back on it, with the amount of injuries we had, I, I think last year we had quite a few concussions. It was right around 15 or 16, uh, which was high. And for us to make the playoffs uh, and, and, you know, actually uh, make a little bit of a, a run there toward the end, I mean, uh, we ran into Aberdeen, who was on their own run, uh, but it was, it, was a, it was a good ride. I, I enjoyed the season. I liked the group of guys we had. We, we could have a lot of them back. We still have to wait uh, to find out who was all going to be back, but uh, I was happy with the season overall. It's just, uh, you know, you always want to win the last game. Because of the many players eligible to return, the Bruins only had a handful of draft picks back in June and focused heavily on the blue line. You know, as far as draft picks and tenders, it really, I didn't have many picks because I could return a lot. I had to protect a lot. Um, you know, we wanted to fill in, obviously, a couple of our leadership holes that are uh, that we lost. Our, our captain for two years, Lane Crenzen, going to the University of Denver, and, uh, you know, that's a big hole to fill. So uh, we drafted a couple of D, actually a few D, uh, three of our four picks that were, were defensemen. And, um, you know, we're hoping that uh, somebody fills that role and just they can, they can log a lot of time in the back end like he did. The Bruins open up their season on September 18th at the NAHL Showcase against the Jamestown Rebels.